Pandora friends. My name is Leanne and I am mad for Pandora. Welcome back to another catalogue video. This is a really old catalogue that my daughter owns and I thought you might like to see it. I have had a few requests to show more old catalogue videos. I love this book. This book's actually a really really good one. I actually wish it, I wish it was mine. <laughs> but it's not, but at least I'll have a digital copy. Now this is really quite old. It was from New South Wales originally, in Australia of course. And I think my daughter just bought it off a lady on eBay at some point. These catalogues are really invaluable. Try not to take too long to go through it. Basically you might you can always pause it if you want to get more details. I just like how the old books show all the different components and examples and stuff like that. Now in my other video I showed you this liquid silver ring. Now this is part of the liquid silver bracelet range. Beautiful one clip and five clip bracelets so. there. Do you remember the um, love pods that they brought out? These were the old rose gold and gold ones and this is white gold. They're amazing, they had diamonds in them. This is that bracelet that I have. And this is the white gold safety chain. I don't know how many people have actually seen that. I don't think everywhere got the white gold. I know Australia did. Pretty stunning. Hopefully you guys can see this all right. I didn't want to be moving the book around too much. These are the old birthday blooms. my old beautiful butterfly cameo that I have. Goes back a long way. Used to have so many Muranos. Look at them like two more 
more than two pages full of sil just the silver Muranos. Crazy. These are the beautiful Timber Muranos. Got a couple of those. And these three are the oversized charms. It's funny, eh? this is when the bird cage and the frog prints was new. That's sort of how I've been working out how old the catalogs are within reason trying to get them in some sort of an order because I can tell when one of the products was new and it wasn't in a previous catalog that's the old clover like the 2020 charm $139 Australian and it was $99 for the new one actually not too bad Okay, we're on to some gold ones. Like I've said before, I just love how Pandora used to use sapphires and diamonds and all that. I know it's expensive, but like if you're getting a gold charm, you sort of, you know, it's great to get the natural stones, even some of the silver pieces and two-tone pieces. It's disappointing that Pandora doesn't do that sort of thing anymore. I remember when I first started collecting, like you'd literally save up for months and months and months or do a lay-by to get the piece that you wanted. There was no specials back then. You didn't have to worry that they were going to be discontinued super quick or anything like that because the charms, they literally stayed there for ages. These ones here are all white gold. And these are the two-tone Muranos. Just some of them are just beautiful. And these ones down here are actually white gold as well. Hopefully this is close enough that you can see it well. And like there's so many, even just the spaces to choose from. Spaces with gems, white gold spaces. Look at the diamonds in the spaces, it's amazing. And the price is amazing too, $599 for white gold and diamond. But for people who have got a lot of money and want to have really good quality jewelry and they might not have lots of bracelets, they just want a really good quality bracelet, there are people that would pay that and have no problems paying that or affording that. These are the Double Diva Clips. I have a couple of those. And this is the one without the stones. I'm not really sure the black one must have already been retired. Oh, that or 
hasn't been made yet according to this book but this has got a black diamond in it diamonds so many gold clips to choose from Okay, we're on to rings. So the reason I wanted to show you this catalogue is because it's super old, but it has rings and other jewellery and stuff in it, whereas a lot of my other really old catalogues are just charms. This is some of the liquid silver range. The ring that I have is not in this book. You probably notice that in Australia we don't have names for a lot of our old charms. The more descriptive titles. Up a few of these rings. so many different options and they've all got pearls or stones it's just amazing I don't get to look at this book very often myself because <laughs> my daughter has it. Hey, there's my ring. I love that ring. So beautiful. So many beautiful gold ones. These are all white gold. These are the love pods. And the rose gold love pods. And these are the yellow gold. They're all diamonds. Stunning, really. Okay, these are the earrings that they had where you can just get a hook or a hoop and design your own combination. I really wish they'd bring this idea back because just you can be so creative just with your earrings. Absolutely stunning. Like even if they don't do the gold, there's plenty of silver options. Really was an amazing concept.
love these big hoops. They're part of the liquid silver range. Okay, I don't know if everybody's seen the concept of using the S-locks. All these chains that just had like a, a link at the end and you hooked both sides with the little S-lock. You've seen the five clip bracelet, this is a four clip necklace. And so you could actually put clips along it. when I wish I had a time capsule. Like look how beautiful that is. Just stunning. watches. I do have some of these watches and one day I'll do a video and show you what I have and how they all work. I just love because you can mix and match them just the same as the bracelets. I hope you enjoyed watching that um, yeah like I said like this is one of the favorite catalogs that my daughter and I have between us it's just really old pieces mostly like necklaces earrings and things like that that we don't have in some of the other catalogs we have lots of catalogs that are like pretty much just charms and stuff but this one's got everything so it's probably, I'd say, the oldest catalog we have with everything. Thank you so much for watching and um, please comment below. Let me know what sort of old Pandora you have. And if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. And if you'd like me to do more catalog videos, please let me know in the comments below. Until next time, take care. Thank mm -hmm. you.